Hi, this is David Williams from My Expert Advisor. In this video, we're going to attach our Expert Advisor to a price chart on the MetaTrader platform. From the welcome screen, you can see the Starter EA icon under Recent Systems. I'll click that and it will open our Starter EA system. This is the main drawing of our system. Now, we've already defined all of our logic functions, but I'd like to go back and add a trailing stop for our cell positions. So I'll double click the caption for the close cell logic function. This will open the drawing for the function. Now I'll put a note into my note element about this new trailing stop. I'm going to add a variable as well and make it an extern so that will make it available from the expert advisor's property window so the user can define whether or not they want to set the trailing stop. So I'll go over to the toolbox under new elements and I'll drag a variable element onto the drawing pad. I'll click the configure button. I'll set the type as boolean. That means it could be true or false. And I'll set the scope to extern. That means it'll be available from the expert advisor property menu. I'll also give it a default value of false. So the trailing stop won't be on unless the user chooses it. I'll choose save as and I want to give this a good name. In this case I'll call it set trailing stop. Select OK and save and the variable is on the drawing. Now I'm going to connect it, connect it to the logic. Now I'm going to the functions toolbox under the VTS menu. I'm going to pull the FN trailing stop function onto the pad. I'll connect that from the true value of the logic. This means if the logic executes true it will run the trailing stop. I'll build this to make sure the drawing is correct. It is. So now I'll configure the logic. The logic will return true when the variable that we created, it's under my variables, under the menu for this system, which is the starter EA, and the variable we just created called set trailing stop. When that's equal to true, will return true. We'll hit save and we'll build the system. After the successful build I'll choose yes to open the MetaTrader platform. This will open our MT platform inside one of the tabs of ETS. I'll close the properties window to give us a little more room. Under the Expert Advisors tab, there's our Starter EA. I'll double click that. Let's check the inputs and look for our new Set Trailing Stop. And there it is. We'll set it to True. Select OK. And now we're running our Expert Advisor with a trailing stop. We don't have a smiley face, so let me go back to Common and check Live Trading. We're now running our Expert Advisor built by the VTS Expert Advisor Builder.